You guys want to see something hardcore? While well, you're looking at him. Yeah. Hello and welcome to another exciting Geometry Dash video. I feel like doing the 100 attempt challenge again where I try to beat a level of each difficulty going from uh, two star all the way up to 10 star difficulty in 100 attempts or less. The way it works is that uh, they're, they're kind of treated as live. So every time I die, I get minus one life. So if I beat the level in one attempt, I don't get minus any attempts. I still have my 100 attempts left. And so I basically have a hundred lives to beat nine levels. So let me get my trusty pencil so I can write down how many lives I have. All right, so I go and I find the newest star rated level in each difficulty category. So I'm gonna be doing a level called Promenade by Arcanon, which is the first two star. I think I'm getting better at language just from reading Geometry Dash descriptions. You guys think is my pronunciation good? I hope I don't lose any lives here. Two star levels are sometimes the hardest because sometimes I don't know when to jump. It says click. Ah, uh, but I don't know. Are the bushes going to kill me? No, no. Okay. The bushes don't kill you. This is, this is so peaceful. Just whenever it says the big clicks, just click. That's very nice. <laughs> Dude, I love it how there's like an animation for clicking. Like, yes, I am that dumb. I need that to succeed. <laughs> Because it looks like there's a bunch of spiky objects. Okay, you got to jump over the cone. You got to jump up the stairs. This is very, this is very relaxing. This is cool. We're in our own little, it's just a chill little rundown city. That's nice. Tickets for the aquarium. Nice. That's cool. We're just, we're just going for a stroll through a city and then into the aquarium. I, this is really relaxing. This is, this is a nice way to get into this challenge today. I will say though. Like, it's very nice, but, like, it's hard to see what's actually going to kill me or not. But the arrows clearly do show you where to jump. But sometimes I think I'm going to run into an object and I'm going to die, you know? That was cool. Just a nice little animated level, like, through a city. It's, like, so chill. That was awesome. I, I really like that. I really like thematic levels like that that have, like, a vibe that stays consistent through the whole level. And this one had that. That was really cool. I have lost zero lives so far. Let's go do a three-star. Estrelatos. There's a lot of three-star levels. There's 1,304 three-star levels. Wow. Should I beat every single two-star and three-star level in the game? Just for the lols? The hardest part of this challenge is waiting for the songs to download. Oh! Okay, here we go. Three-star. Oh, oh, dude! Cool, man! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Whoa, where'd it go? Dude, that's like... A, it's a, it was a sound diamond. Sound diamond. This is cool, man. Dude, I love this. This is great. So, like, trippy, you know? With all, like, the neon and neon lights and neon effects with the hearts and the stars. Like, hey, that's that's cool, man. I like the, I like this level's style. This is really... Oh, yeah, I got it for the coin path. But is the coin path going to be harder? I, sh I probably shouldn't have done that. Because sometimes you take coin paths and the coin paths, like, in easier levels end up being really hard. Dude, I liked being like sucked up into space like that. You see that? That was awesome. We got like beamed up. So cool, man. Okay, so I didn't get a coin though, did I? <laughs> I thought I unlocked a coin path, but did I get a coin? I don't know what happened. I didn't get a coin! You just gotta unlock the coin path and then you gotta find the coin path. That's complex, man. All right, that was, that was really cool. That was an awesome three star. I, uh... Didn't lose any lives either. Cool, we're still at a hundred lives. Okay, a bunch of five stars. We need to find, what? I've done the newest four star level in like the last challenge. Really, there hasn't been a four star level since. Well, I guess we're doing the second one then, which is the long night by Hanster. Okay, and this one is a medium length level. The last level we played was medium length as well, which uh, pretty pretty short levels. So let's go. That, that bodes well for me. Look at that, we're already at 14%. Wow. We're, Marty, I feel like I haven't played much and I'm a quarter of the way through the level. All right, I mean, you know what? I will I will 100% take it. I will, I will certainly take it. I feel like I've played this level before. But maybe I haven't. Did I, like, get this in a mod stream? No, no, no. No, no, no. I definitely haven't. Definitely haven't played this level. Okay, let's go. Man, I'm at 60%. I mean, it's a cool level, but holy crap, is it ever, like, short? I should have went for the coin, you know? We're getting, we're getting pretty lucky with levels today. Oh, dude, that's that's really nice looking. That like, 
angelic figure with the orb, whatever it is. Where, where do we go from here? I mean, really cool level, but for a level called The Long Night, it sure was short, which isn't a bad thing, but I felt like it could have been a little bit longer, you know? All right, man, I haven't died a single life. What can stop me? I, I am tempting fate by saying that. Okay, a lot of five stars, though. So the newest rated five stars level called Sweet Party by Azor GD. Finally, a new level. I hope you like it. Cool. A collab. Let's go. The thing about this challenge is that, man, eight, nine star and easy demons can be rough, you know? They can, they can be really rough because some of them can just be like unsight readable. Okay, I mean, this could be, this could be a little deadly for me because this is like a kind of a modern style level. And I'm, I'm such a... That was a spike. It looked like that was an indicator, right? I went down like, do we got to go down and up? But no, of it's a spike. It's so hard sometimes to tell the difference between indicators and spikes, you know? This, okay, so the indicators are animated. You can see how they like kind of move. So we're in a bubble. I guess that helps us like breathe underwater or some stuff. Yeah, that's like, that's like the thing about this level. Breathing underwater. Well, I guess we escaped that. We escaped the bubbly. I can read this, dude. Just pure ship gameplay. Okay, UFO. We can do UFO. You can make a lot of mistakes really fast as the UFO, which can be an issue. I, I much prefer like wave and ship gameplay because it's just like, it feels like it's more pure skill. And because it's pure skill, it's much easier to sight read unless you're, are you kidding me? As I was saying, wave and ship gameplay in easier levels is nice because it's much easier to sight read um, because it is like high skill. And we're like timings, like if you just misclick by the tiniest little bit, you can't recover. Like you're just screwed. You accidentally jumped and now you're screwed. But with a ship, like I can accidentally like mistime something a little bit, but there's so much leeway, right? Um, so like, it doesn't really matter. Same with the wave. So like in easier levels, you want like the high skill game modes, you know? I mean, timing, there's a lot of like high skill timing parts in levels, don't get me wrong, but, but you know, it's, it's different. It's easier to recover from your mistakes in a ship and wave game mode. And to a lesser extent, UFO. UFO, you can recover. Ooh, this part looks cool. Whoa, fast, some fast inputs, bro. Okay. Okay, come on. We're not gonna die anymore, yeah? You, you guy held down the button too long. You Black jump orbs are the worst. I got it. Got it. Dude, I was so close to the end. Come on. Come on. I got a coin though from hitting all the switches, I imagine, right? Which means I got the quest done. I should get bonus lives for getting the quest done. I got all three coins, what? It's just you gotta hit the switches to get the coins. Wow. Oh, wow. Let's go collect. Okay. Four attempts. I died three times. Minus three lives. I'm at 97 lives. 97. Gotta, gotta keep track of that. I almost like just skipped doing the whole life thing. Okay, now we're on to harder levels. Six star. This level is called... I might have mispronounced that. Let me try one more time. Six stars, 97 lives. Not bad. We've only lost three so far. What is the dude? Oh my goodness. That started out with a bang. Okay. So there's not going to be indicators for everything. There are some indicators. Not indicators for everything. Interesting. Let's just one it. Let's just one attempt this bad boy then. Because I don't want to go through that beginning again. I feel like I kind of fluked it. This is an easier level. I mean, it's a harder level, but it's one of the easier ones that we'll be doing today. Oh, I thought I was dead there. I thought I didn't make it. That could theoretically like cost me a lot of lives. Whoa, I was supposed to go up top there. Dude, I'm having a hard time reading this level. Like I like the green. What the heck? There's multiple ways to go and it's freaking me out, man. Like just give me one path. Don't make me make decisions. Like there's so many arrows going in all different ways and I'm just having a okay okay i see i see i see i see oh nice dude indicators here up the who's on nice i like it everywhere indicators everywhere yes dune 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 yeah have a man base on bahama gonna do it gonna win gotta win baby i won okay that was cool i only died one Ooh. life that's that's very that's very acceptable 96 lives left very acceptable that's cool. I like the like simple green style. I guess it's cool. Okay, the next one is a seven star, which is blacklist by binary six six six. Let's try this again. This must have been a daily level because the download count is insane. At this rate, if I have enough lives left, you know what? If I have enough lives left, I'm gonna go for a bonus. We're gonna try to do a medium demon as well. That'd be cool. I should just do that every time with my remaining lives. If I do the run successfully, like go for a medium demon as well and see how far I can get. 
But having beaten the easy demon one level of each difficulty it means a successful run, of course. Blacklist. However, all it takes is one level to be really hard and then it's game over, you know? And it doesn't even have to be like particularly super hard, just unsight readable. Like a level that has like some kind of memorization component to it in a way. And then I'm like screwed, right? Okay, whoa. Dude, that looked like pretty tight, man. Like seven star, you guys, you guys sure about that? Okay, now it's, now it's a little bit easier. Yeah, easy to sight read this. First part, for some reason, I was having trouble sight reading it. Okay, we're halfway through, halfway through. Oh, dude, yeah, now it's, now it's chilled out a little bit. I feel like, yeah, I feel like those spaces at the beginning were pretty tight. I like this tight gameplay. Like, whoa, I almost didn't press it there. I always miss the black jump orbs, man. Like, why? Why am I like this? Oh, that was a lot of inputs. We're going. We're one attempting it, baby. Yes, you're going to turn me into a ship. Yes, I can just fly it in. What was that? I Why did I fly down so far? I, like, I tapped it to straighten myself out. Is there like a... There's no jump pad there, is there? No. Oh my god, no. Oh, I could have one attempted. That, 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 that's... I'm shook. I'm absolutely shook. Okay, just... Oh, you, dude, I did, like basically just had to not press anything. That's so funny. And sad! Yes! Ow! I hurt my thumb the other day because I was cleaning and I, I tore some skin off it. And I just clapped on it. Why would I do this? Why would I do this? Dude, we're killing it today. We're killing it. I just finished the seven star and I'm at 95 lives left. Oh my God. Lightning reflex by Adone. Oh my God, that sounds fast. Seven months. That's a long time. Okay. Lightning reflex. Let's go. Lightning. Dude, I don't have lightning reflexes. I'm old. How do you, ex how do you expect me to have lightning reflexes? Oh, oh. It's going too fast. I can't handle this. Okay, we're already at 20%. Not bad, not bad. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, nice. Pretty easily sight read so far, actually. Even though it is, it's fairly fast paced. Oh, I almost jumped and I almost died. Whoa, dude, I lost sight of myself. Okay. Man. I, I, dude, the speed changes are wild. I like this level. It's really fun. It's really intense, but it is like really, uh, you got a lot, quite a long time to put your inputs in when it goes faster. Like it's really well, the difficulty between like the slow and the fast ports feels really well balanced. It's good. What happened? Okay. Um, so I've died. How many lives have I died? So I'm on attempt five means I've died four lives. So. Go down to 91 lives, and I'm going to go into practice mode. We'll go into practice mode. So, I'll just count how many times I die here, I guess. Okay. So, there's one life lost. It says attempt three. So, when I go into practice mode, it counts as... It, it starts in normal as one attempt, then I go into practice mode, and that's like another attempt. So, I've been kind of counting wrong, I guess. Because I've died once, and it says attempt three, which is really weird. Okay. Anyways. Oh, dude, that's... Pretty intense. That's a that's really cool looking, man. But yeah, that part was like super intense. I'm probably gonna die there in normal mode. Oh, do you just hold down the button? No. What? What? That's hard. Oh wow, that that's hard. So I think I died four times because it counted two attempts. One attempt to go into normal mode, and then it said attempt two when I started practice, and it was six attempts at the end. So it's four lives lost. So that's so confusing. <laughs> the attempt, the way it counts attempts. It's so weird. Nope. Dude, it bumps you. What the heck is that? It like, I'm flying in the middle and then it bumps me up. Why? What is that? What? Oh, I knew I was gonna die at that part. Man, that's the hardest part of the level. Shoot.
Okay, got it. Nice. Okay. That wasn't so bad. I had a few more attempts than I thought I was going to die at that level, but overall, it's within acceptable parameters. We're doing all right. So that was another two lives lost. So we're at 85 lives left. Okay. 85. Nice. We're on the nine star, which is still vibing. 1.9 level. Ugh. 1.9 levels are interesting because a lot of them are really fun. Don't get me wrong, but a lot of them are really learning and there's fakes and there's not good indicators on some of them. So, ah, this could be bad. We have 85 lives left for two levels, this and the easy demon. However, whenever I get a 1.99 star level, I end up losing like 50 lives on it. So, <laughs> oh no, I should just go into practice mode right away. Let's just, let's see what it's like in normal mode first. Although that looks fair. Okay, good. dude, this is a banger 1.9 level. That I mean, that looks awesome. Okay, very sight readable. What was I worried about? And this just looks cool, man. This like looks really cool. I wonder if I would die. Oh, you gotta wait there. Okay, let's try one more time in normal mode. And then I think I'll go into practice because I'm really not that far. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Dude, banger 1.9 level. And then spam. Okay, yeah, we're going to go into practice mode. So I've died two lives. So I'm at 83. Oh, you got to keep on smashing them. Dude, that's confusing. Oh, dude, this UFO part is a little wild, man. Holy dude. Oh, my God. The wave's not bad. That UFO part is so hard, though. Okay. Okay, dude. All just. Dude, give me like a lot more of this. I can handle this. Okay. Man, I've lost a lot of lives. Oh, fake. Yeah, yeah. Here, here it comes. The fakes. No. How am I still alive? <laughs> this is so hard. It's an easy demon. Wow, this is nine star. Okay. Dude, I can do this stress test at the end. No big deal. Oh, no, I can't. Apparently. What? Oh, my God. That's a, that's a really cool level, but it's just, it's got some learning parts. 26 attempts, so that's 24, because switching to practice takes a few times. 57. Oh, 24 now. That'd be 59. Dude, 1.9 levels, man. Like I said, 1.9 levels are really fun, but they're always, like, pretty learning. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, okay, okay. How many times did I die? Oh, shh. I didn't check. But I think I can remember because I didn't die very many times. Oh my god. Oh my god, I think I died four times. If I'm wrong... Redonk. My editor, just please correct me. <laughs> I think I died four times. I've had 55 lives left. However, correct me if I'm wrong, Redonk. I bite. Hopefully that doesn't affect the run. Let's go. So I got this. 55 lives. I can remember. It's just all about remembering. It's not particularly like... This is not particularly hard. I shouldn't say that. It's just remembering what's to come. The UFO part is going to get me, though. Man, the UFO part is actually, like, super scary. It does go really well with the song, though. Oh, that's that. See, that part, I always feel like I'm a little too high there. Smoke weed every day. It's, mm, man, the UFO, it would be nice if it was a little more forgiving. Just a little more. Because as it stands, it's way harder than the rest of the level. A little more forgiving. Oh, God. It's just a UFO, man. It's so much harder than the rest of the level. I feel like I might beat it once I get past the UFO. Oh my god! <laughs> no, no! I couldn't remember the, the ball. Ah! Oh, that hurts. Okay. As long as I don't die the UFO anymore. God, dude, I just. Yeah. Oh. oh, did I seriously buffer that? I just, it's so unbelievable, man. I don't know why I have such a hard time with that transition because it just boops you up so quick. And then you got to input, you got to go down immediately. Oh, I was like getting ready for it too. I was like, you're ready for the ball. Don't die to the ball. Oh man.
That was so close. <laughs> that was so hard. It's, it's, you know what? It's really consistent. It's just hard to figure out. The UFO, I was getting it towards the end, but man, like when you're, when you got to spam and like you bounce on that, it's not really spam. It's just like, doo -doo. you don't got to press it that fast, but like you can get out of control a little bit. It was just hard, man. Okay, so minus nine lives from 55 is we're at 46. Oh my God. That's a cool level, man. That's a really cool 1.9 level. Like visually with only the 1.9 objects you can use. Like it did a lot. It was really cool and really fun. Uh, just some parts, man. Some parts were hard. Let's hope that the easy demon is easy. Sleepwalker by Vismuth. You need to sleep. I do, but sleep is for the week. Yeah, actually, that's not true. <sighs> 46 attempts. Hey, yeah. Pray with me. This is a chill easy demon. Let's go into the comments and see what happens. GG 48 attempts with two coins. Ooh, 40 attempts with two coins. Oh, 2,590 demons though. <laughs> Okay. Uh oh. Oh no. This level's fantastic, but holy hell, this is not an easy demon. No. What are we getting ourselves into? 40, 46 lives. What are we getting ourselves into? Oh, that's tight. But I'm decent at flying, so if it's just like 100% skill based stuff like this, yeah. Let's go. But yeah, for an easy demon, I can see. Holy shoot. I'm going right into practice. We're at 45. I mean, there's arrows telling me where to go, which is nice, but I think there's a cool level here, but I'm just so focused on the gameplay. Oh, uh, when do I got to press something? No. Oh, I mean, that that's dude. That's cool. I like that. Okay. No, this is very easy to read. When the crazy trippy colors are out like this, I have a hard time reading that kind of gameplay. Yeah, there's some. It is deceivingly tight here. Wow. Well, like how and am I dying there? Oh, Yo, you gotta hold that. You have to hold down the button there. Oh, come on. Really? You gotta, you gotta buffer. You gotta jump as soon as the dude. That was weird, man. Like, why was that so much harder than it needed to be? Huh? What are with these timings, bro? Like, you don't jump at the arrow for a lot of those. Like, getting into those one block gaps. Like, sometimes, like. Oh, no. It's so annoying. Oh, that part's so hard. Oh my god. The rest level's not that bad. That part was so hard. And it was so slow. Well, don't think I'm gonna be doing this. I'm gonna need, like, a goddamn miracle, you know? Holy shit, it's so hard. <laughs> oh, man! I got so unlucky! No! I got so unlucky, dude. 41 attempts, 39. I gotta do this in like six lives or maybe even five lives if I miscounted previously. It's not gonna happen. It's, dude, something so weird. Some of these timings, like in that slow part, man, like sometimes you gotta hold down the button. Sometimes you gotta wait, but whenever you jump, it's never at like the actual indicator. Oh my God, dude. And then there's this part uh, that is no way. Uh, GG's man. GG's, you wrecked me, level. Oh, God. I always think I'm just going to land on, like, the top platform, but then I see, like, the... This is really hard to read. Like, it's a really hard to read level. It's cool looking, but it's really hard to read what's going on. Oh, you don't... You got to jump when you're on... <sighs> so I think I failed. <laughs> Easy demon, you crazy! That's the worst luck I've gotten for an easy demon ever, I think, in this challenge. <sighs> Shoot, dude! It's, this level's wrecking me! It's so hard. It's just it's, it's hard. Why? Like, I, I'm trying to jump there and I, I keep on bouncing off the slope. I don't know if that's a bug or a feature. Oh my God. This is 
<sighs> this is the worst kind of level to get in this challenge for sure. It's so learny and hard. Oh no, I remembered in that part like, oh, you got to smash the bottom and go off a slope. And I forgot that it wasn't like right after the jump orb. Ugh. Why? I pressed the button, you stupid idiot level. <laughs> oh my God, I've died there so many times. Dude, I just... Oh my god. Those jumps in the section are so tight. Sometimes you jump at the arrow, but it kills you anyways. It's like, come, just, mm, come on, man. Oh my god. Come on, man. I knew I was going to die to that. It's just like the song goes really well to the portals. And so ding, and there's like a ding there. And I always want to hit the button to like the music sync, right? But you got to wait. Ah. What? Oh. Ugh. <laughs> oh my god easy demon that took me like all of my lives like 117 dude i haven't spent 117 attempts on an easy demon for quite a long time <laughs> that's so hard bro bro Bruh! I mean, you know what? It's a cool level. I'll give it that. Like, it visually, I love the aesthetic. And uh, gameplay, for the most part, is really good. I would say there's just, there's a few parts, like, in the mini cube where the indicators don't really show you exactly where to jump, where, like, if you jump at the indicator, you'll die, you know? You gotta, like, hold down the button and jump earlier. But I'm not too sure if that's a 240 hertz thing or not. I, I'm not too sure. Um, It's really cool level. Really cool. When the gameplay is fun, the gameplay is really fun. Um, me and Slopes, I guess we just don't get along. I think me and this level, we just weren't on the same wavelength. This level wanted to go right, and here I was trying to go left. And then, like, you just bleh, I splatted all over this level and died so many times. Like, I think, objectively, this is a fantastic level. It's just me and it, I don't know what it was. I had a hard time reading the gameplay at some moments. You know, I had a hard time. Uh, following the correct robot jumps. I had a hard time with clearly the UFO at the end, which I didn't think was that hard, um, but I got out of control a few times. Um, but man, mostly, a lot of times I died to slopes. Like when you change into the mini cube at 53% or whatever, I would go and try to jump at the indicator, but I would bounce off the slope and fall off. So I just jumped before the slope, even though the indicator says to jump on the slope. So like, I don't know. I was having a hard time with slopes in this level. Like slopes were killing me 50 to 60% of the time probably 240 hertz thing really cool level but it just for this challenge <laughs> not a good level for this challenge man oh that was so hard holy shoot that's the hardest easy demon i've ever had in this challenge like by a long shot that was crazy man i got wrecked 
Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, this challenge is really exciting. It's also really stressful, which is why I like it, because as the life count is going down, I get more and more stressed out. So there's definitely like a mental component to it, which is why I really like doing it. And so uh, I stress out more than normal when I get towards the end, like at the easy demons. Um, but I think that's all part of the fun. All these levels we played today are really good in their own way. Really amazing. Um, all the way from the, the, the two star all the way up to, uh, you know, the easy demon. Like they were all, they're all great levels. And even though I stress out and <laughs> I yell at levels, like don't take it the wrong way. These are all still fantastic levels. I just, you know. Stress out, man. It's a stressful challenge. That's all. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Leave a thumbs up. Helps me out a lot. And as always, peace.